Prepare to explore. Get out of the city and into an adventure that moves the whole family. Prepare to be moved. The all new Nissan X Trail. On air, online, and on your smart speaker. BettyBlue.com.au. Shop anywhere, anytime. SAFM News Briefing. Hi, it's Dan Flake here with the latest. Entertainer Barry Humphreys will be farewelled at a joint state funeral, according to the PM. Anthony Albanese has told UK reporters New South Wales and Victoria will share duties with the Commonwealth. Humphreys died aged 89 last month. Flags are flying at half-mast at fire stations across Queensland today following the death of one of their own. Isabella Nash lost her life battling a blaze at a factory in Slacks Creek south of Brisbane yesterday. A second firefighter remains in a serious but stable condition in hospital. The state's Acting Fire and Emergency Services Commissioner Mike Warsing says an investigation into what's happened is underway. I can assure you that we want the answers too for Izzy for Leah, for their families and for their colleagues. The countdown's on until we hear more about plans for a Tasmanian AFL site. CEO Gil McLaughlin's heading to the state today where he's expected to meet with several big names, including the state's Premier. All 18 clubs unanimously voted for the next licence to go to Tassie yesterday. A bit of drama four days out from the King's coronation. A man's in police custody after a controlled explosion was carried out outside Buckingham Palace that forced it into temporary lockdown. This Australian, Victoria Saunders, was working the night shift at a London hotel nearby at the time and says her colleagues were all pretty shocked. It's interesting because it's so close. Whereas we haven't really had too much of a kerfuffle coming up to it. And cost of living may be biting, but Aussies are still spending. The latest ABS data has shown a rise in retail turnover in March of 0.4 of a percent, with food sales playing a big part. After this, there is no turning back. You sip the red can, the story ends. You sip the black can, you enter dreamland. And I show you just how good the truth can taste. Max Taste Challenge. These coach Simon Goodwin is confident rival clubs will embrace a 19th team in Tasmania despite the challenges they'll face with the concessions the new side will receive from the AFL. The details still to come about the impact of what that's going to look like, but if you look at the fundamental for our game, it's just great for our game. So I think everyone's going to embrace it, everyone's going to get behind it. Melbourne's expected to welcome back Charlie Spargo and Harrison Petty for Saturday's clash with Gold Coast. And in cricket, Australia's been dethroned by India as the world's number one test team just a month out from the World Test Championship. Buying or selling rural or residential properties? Miller, Juan and John. This is SAFM weather. A cloudy afternoon across the limestone coast, dropping to 7 degrees tonight. Back up to 16 tomorrow though, rain possible. Want more local news? Get free breaking news about our community. Download the Listener app, search for the limestone coast and add to your favourites now.